Hello ladies and gentlemen, Top Hat Gaming Man here and welcome to Top Hat Chat. I am joined here once again by my companion, um, Luke Street. Hello. Which is um, a rather boring um, name in comparison to my own, I suppose. <sighs> boring, it's two sides of a coin really, me and you. Um... So yes, like what's a better channel to subscribe to? Um, oh yes, you've not got a channel yet, but Top Hat Gaming Man or Luke Street. <laughs> My name's more memorable, but anyway, I'm going off subject. Let's talk about um, GoldenEye and um, a game which is, in my opinion, overrated. And personally, well, not personally, but it, that's an opinion that's shared by many people online these days. In fact, you could even argue that it's become a victim of the, the game's become a victim of the YouTube echo chamber. Whereas quite a few people say it's overrated. Now, most people think it's overrated. So, what do you think about that? Well, I'm not one of those people. I love Goldeneye. I love everything about it. I, I remember spending hours and hours and hours with all of my friends gathered in the same room taking turns, you know, shooting at each other and trying to be competitive. It caused arguments, it caused fights. Everybody wanted to be odd job because he was smaller and had a smaller hitbox. Yes, he had um, a nice hat too. I have to say that. <laughs> yeah. So, exactly. So, what's not to like about Goldeneye? Yeah, honestly, who throws a shoe? <laughs> but um, yes, Goldeneye. Um, what I'll say is, I agree with you there. When I was a youngster in um, secondary school, being all of my friends, we all loved Goldeneye. It was one of those games which literally everybody loved. It wasn't like the old days where you either liked Sonic or you liked Mario. Goldeneye, on the other hand, it was the first time I can recall um, where everybody I knew loved playing a game on a Nintendo console. It yeah. wasn't divisive like other games I played from Nintendo at the time. Literally everyone loved it. Yeah, so what's not to like? You said you don't like it. I believe it's kind of um, aged very badly. Like I like games that age like fine wine, whereas um, Goldeneye, on the other hand, is kind of aged like... What's a good metaphor there? Have you, have you played it recently? I have played it recently, oh, yes. So what was what didn't hold up about it? The graphics, yes, but graphics aren't the be-all and end-all. It's, it's the controls. I like the controls. And let's be honest, the Nintendo 64 controller has never been one of the greatest controllers anyway. It's actually one of my favourites. Yeah. Seriously? Uh, yeah. Did you just hear that? That was almost a real re, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. You were very, very angry about it. That was this. nearly a real re. Yeah, it, it, it's one of my favourite controls ever because it had some versatility to it. But you needed three hands to play it, really. No, you never used both. Well, you kind of vaguely it would have used helped, both. It? it would have helped. A, and you a could third have hand a, would have been helpful. It would, yes. But it's a great, great thing. It feels good in your hands. No, it, it seems remember, to work. Because you've only got one analog stick and it's a first-person shooter. You had to do something really weird, didn't you? Control movement or something with the C buttons, maybe? And you aimed uh, with the with the stick. It's been a long time. Yeah, it, probably. it felt. It controls like very that. weird. In I remember to modern first-person shooters. Yeah, compared to modern, but it, it worked. It but that's fun. why it's aged bad, in my opinion. It's not at the same level as modern first-person shooters. And I'm not even somebody who likes modern first-person shooters. No, you do have a serious hatred. For but. If you look at like a lot of modern um, like 2D side scrollers yeah. and retro, well that's a bad word, old 2D yeah. side scrollers, some of the old ones are better than a lot of the modern ones. You can't really say that about Goldeneye, I don't think. Uh, yeah, okay. You can't I do go agree. back for a better experience than what's available on the market today. But again, when you play f four versus four with a load of people in a room. You can't have more fun on any other game. Surely you can. No, you just there must be you modern first-person shooters where you can do the same. Yeah, you can, but it's not as fun. It must be, sure. It's not. Yeah, it this better. is designed to, to get people together. I agree, and I believe it served its purpose in 1997. I do not feel it can serve the purpose in the same way today when you've got superior games on the market. I think if I put out on my Facebook that I'm having... No, no, seriously, seriously. If I put out on my Facebook, right, to my large group of friends, right, anyone want to come over on Saturday and we can play Goldeneye and have a few beers? Yes, right? because they would turn up and we would play and we would enjoy ourselves. If I put on there, does anybody want to come round on Saturday and we can play some Call of Duty? I would get one reply. Yes, but that's is nostalgia. And that's for the people, beer. People aren't going for the beer. People are going for the nostalgia. They're not going for the gameplay. They are going for the nostalgic experience. And because in their heads, because they've not played it for so long, they genuinely believe it is better than the modern first-person shooters. I think if I did it one week and they did it again the next week, I think they'd come back. 
Maybe we should actually try this as a video yeah, on the channel. Yeah, I think we at should. some point see what actually yeah, happens. But yeah. personally, yes, I think it's overrated now. Like if you compare it to 2018 games. Uh, is the BZ 2018 games? So, 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 2018 so, for a couple of days. You know, modern games. So which games that came out in the last year have you really enjoyed more than Goldeneye? We talk about first person shooting Well, games. in the same genre. In the same genre? I really liked Borderlands. Did that come out this year? I've not played any modern. the last year. I've not played modern. first person shooting. That's modern. Exactly. That's modern. So, exactly. So you're saying that the other games are better, but you hate them all and prefer this? What I'm saying is, the first person shooter genre has gone through a period of progression because there's been far too many of them. A ridiculous amount of first person shooters have been made. It's yeah, the most overhyped genre, perhaps, in the history of gaming, other than probably um, football games. Yeah. Football games and first person shooters. Um, too many. There's too many of them in existence, and too many people only play those genres because they're lowbrow morons, quite frankly. But due to the vast amount of first-person shooters being pumped out, they've transcended and got to a level much higher than this. I do not know because I've stopped playing them because I'm bored of them. I believe uh, did they reach a stage of saturation where they've got to a level and then it's kind of plateaued? Has that happened with them? And they've, um, have they reached plateaued in their quality? Yeah, I mean, I'm not talking about graphics. I'm talking about gameplay. Has the gameplay plateaued? Essentially, it kind of did. I mean, you had the whole thing with Call of Duty. Call of Duty came out and it was gritty games. Like, oh, yeah, it was like, um, if you're going back to some of the older ones, the original World at War, it was a gritty game, you know? And then they started entering all the double jumps and all the futuristic stuff that just literally destroyed the franchise. It was awful. Okay. And I think that the gameplay, as far as that, it got to so about there to and it was awful. It went back down again. But then they've had releases this year. They've had Call of Duty World War II. Uh, Battlefield 1. Um... Okay, say this honestly. Do you believe that Goldeneye is one of the best first person shooters in existence today? As many people seem to believe it is. I, would... um, I think it was. No, not was. We're talking about today. I would pick it up over a lot of the ones that came out in the past five years. Okay. I can't really answer that question for sure because I've not played them in abundance. But I'm just making the inference that there probably are games that are a lot better quality because the games that I played before were a lot better than this. Like I said, yeah. like the Borderlands, um, like Bioshock. Is Bioshock I, first mention? Which would have first mention? Uh, essentially, it's, it's yeah, yeah, vaguely just. Even I played a little bit of Call of Duty. I think uh, the last one I played was Call of Duty Two. I think. <laughs> Came out quite. What, what do you love? That's, that's, that's yeah. a modern game for me. Yeah. That is a modern game. Yeah, that is modern for you, Rich. Yes. Yeah. 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 Um, I, I would still pick Goldeneye up. I still think it's a good a good game. I think that a lot of people that enjoy first person shooters could enjoy Goldeneye. I don't see a problem. I think if they, you're gonna hate me for this. I think if they remastered it properly, I think it would still be a good game. If they remastered it, yes, because because then they can use modern technology, can't they? So that's but, uh, that's kind of cheating. We're talking about this Goldeneye. Hate, but you hate remasters, right? You're being a politician about this. You, what, I want you to tell me that Goldeneye is overrated. I demand you, you tell me that the game is overrated. <laughs> Based on everything I've told you. I've been educating you for probably about 10 minutes now. No, I, I, I physically can't tell you because it's it's too good of a game. It just is. I'd, I'd still have fun on it now. If I started playing the campaign now, I wouldn't put it down until I finished it. I, I wouldn't get bored. Okay. I wouldn't get bored of it. I wouldn't. So basically, we are refusing to agree on this one. So I have to say the results regarding Goldeneye being overrated as inconclusive, sadly. Although, maybe we can change this. Ladies and gentlemen of the comment section, let me know what you think about Goldeneye. Is the game overrated in 2018? So we're not talking about the game's impact it had at the time. We are talking about how it functions as a game today. Yeah. Cheerio. Cheerio.